Hello. This is either going to turn out super awesome or be a super crazy hot mess. So we're going to see what happens. But the challenge continues. We got challenged to do a whole bunch of different fall looks. I'm going to try flannel. <laughs> and I was like racking my brain on how I'm going to do this. So if you're watching the replay, please comment replay and let me know that you watched. Um, this... I kind of know where to start, and I kind of don't. So, we're going to see how this goes. I have a look in mind. I have an image to kind of go off of. And I don't know if I should show it or not. Because <laughs> I don't know how close I'm going to get. It's going to be similar. Similar-ish. Similar-ish. Um, I'm going to see if I can't get this shared out quick and get some people watching here. Um... I, I don't know. We're, we're going to try. We're going to try. <laughs> it, um, I was going to wait for this one for last, but I figure I should probably just get this one out, out of the way. <laughs> Cause this one is going to be, it's going to be nuts. Like I said, it's either going to look really cool or it's going to look really crazy. Um, so flannel, flannel is what we're is what we're going for. Um, try and get this shared out here quick. I don't know why. If I use my laptop, I can get stuff shared out super quick. But what am I doing? Oh, my, I got a spare phone here. My phone that was like, it's hanging on by a thread. It's forever and a million years old. But um, if you're watching live, please say hi. Let me know that you're here. And get this shared out to some groups here so we can get some people watching. And support me in a um, crazy flannel look. <laughs> it um, I think that I, I have an idea. And I have a picture to go off of. But other than that, I, um, I don't know how this is going to go. But uh, I'm going to try. I'm for sure going to try. Okay, I'll share it off to a couple groups. We'll see what happens. We'll see if anybody joins me. If you're watching live, please say hi. Um, I can see numbers, but I can't see. I can't always see who you are. So flannel. Okay, let me go back to my picture. <laughs> oh my gosh. The stuff I've been challenged to do is crazy. But this is what I'm going for. Can I do it? I went through, like, I was looking at flannel shirts. I was like, I looked for flannel eye looks, flannel makeup looks. I saw one gal that did her lips, like, red and green kind of flannel-like, and that looked kind of cool. So I'm like, okay, how am I going to do this, though? Because whatever my base is needs to be, like, pretty intense. So I'm going to use lipstick. I'm going to use, I did do this. I did not this color. I used um, Nude Essence, and I did a fun trying out using the matte liquid lipstick as an eyeshadow because the matte liquid lipstick once it's dried down it doesn't move so i'm going to try it with this one it's a little bit lighter so you can kind of tell the difference here this is the two that i have this is nude essence and then this is um au naturel au naturel something like that these are the numbers it's 203 is the one i'm using so it's a little it's lighter pink but i'm gonna use this one as a base because once it's dry it's dry and it won't budge so to, in order to get the lines I need it dry. So this is what I'm going for. It's not going to be the same shade. But this is what I'm going for. And dear God, we're going to see what happens. <laughs> it, um, like I said, it's either going to look really cool or it's going to be a super crazy hot mess. I, and I don't really do, I've never done a wing. And I've, I have not mastered the upper eye liner. So I don't have a lot of like the pencils or not the pencils I do have the pencils I don't have like the what the heck do you call them like ink liner an ink liner I think would make this a lot easier I have one but I've noticed it it's it's not the best quality it's one that I've had for probably too long it's probably expired and I should probably not be using it but I'm gonna put the base on first and then let that dry while I do the rest of my face and then come back to it and 
and attempt it. I think I'm just going to do the flannel on one eye and then I'm going to do, I have kind of a fun idea for the other eye. So we're going to see how it works. Like I'm going to put the matte liquid lipstick on first to, so that it has time to dry while I put on the rest of my face. So we're going to see how this goes. If you're watching live, please say hi and let me know you're here. And um, cheer me on here because we're going to see how this goes. So this is Au Naturel, Au Naturel. I do put it onto a brush so I'm not putting the actual applicator onto my eye because that's like kind of gross. So this is going to be my base. So it's actually a really pretty color, but I'm going to go, it's going to be crazy. I'm going to do my whole eyelid. So that I got room to get my flannel markings in. My eyebrows need help. It is crazy that you can use lipstick on your eyes though. Super crazy. Okay. So there's the one base. So I'm just going to do that for now. Well, I'm going to do that on that eye and then I'm going to do just a little bit on the other eye. Because I do have like, I'm just going to do the flannel on one side and see how it turns out, this eye's not gonna be as crazy. Cause I feel like if I tried to do both eyes and then I would wanna try and make a match and I feel like I'd be here all night. But I wanted to have it time, or let it have time to dry. So it's gonna look super crazy for a minute. Need that to come down. I'm trying to kind of make a square out of my eye ish. Like I said, this is either going to turn out super cool or be a crazy, crazy mess. Okay, I'm going to let that dry. And do my face so that this, so I got something to work with here. Because we're going to do the lines on top. Because I'm attempting, it's not going to be the same shades. But I'm going to attempt, I need to do that one. That needs to be darker. But I'm going to attempt to do flannel. A flannel look on my eyes. I don't know what, um, whoever made this challenge, I'm not so sure what she was thinking when she meant flannel. But I'm taking it as um, a fun eye look. But I'm gonna make this a little bit darker because I'm gonna. It's I'm doing like pink flannel is what I'm going for. And the picture is actually plaid, but I'm pretty sure flannel and plaid are like the same thing. Right? Tell me if I'm wrong, but I think so. Cause like I said I was looking at flannel shirts. I was looking at like anything flannel. I'm like, what does she mean? What is flannel? What is that? <laughs> We're going to see. Um, okay, I'm going to let that dry. I'm going to do the rest of my face. And I have not put foundation. Hey, Robin. Robin, I'm trying out flannel. I'm not exactly sure what, um, what she meant by that. <laughs> but I have an idea. And um, we're starting off with the base here. But I have not put foundation on my whole entire face all week. So we have a mask mandate now, and I just don't really see a point of um, putting foundation where my mask is going to be covering me when I'm looking at anybody. Doing flannel tomorrow, i got a great look for it. <sighs> I'm curious to see. I, nobody's done this one yet, so I'm like the first, and I'm going to look at other people and be like, oh... I could have done that, but I have an idea. We're going to see if it works. We're going to see. Meantime, I need some lip conditioner. If you haven't tried lip conditioner, do it. It's legit. 
So I'm gonna end up doing a fun lip too. I got plans. I got plans too. So I'm gonna try and book it through through some of this because my eye this, this is gonna take some time. So ooh poop and I have to use a brush because I forgot to dampen my beauty blender. Oh darn it! I'm excited for your look. Well, I'm glad you are. <laughs> we're gonna see. Oh, we're gonna see how this goes. And I'm not concealing or anything like that. I've got some mask knee going on. That is a thing. Luckily, in Podunk, North Dakota, we are just now getting the the wrath of um, current circumstances. I don't even want to say the word or the term. We all know what I'm talking about. But um, Bismarck has now become a hot spot. So we are under mask mandate now and all that jazz and whatever. I'm not going to sit here completely and complain but um mask me is a thing like i've been hearing about it and i i didn't doubt it but i'm experiencing it like it is totally a thing and it's rough so i have not been putting any foundation below like where my mask is because the only time i'm not wearing a mask when i'm out in public is when i'm in my office by myself so nobody sees me anyway so anytime anybody sees me i have a mask on this is VFX foundation. And I'm just kind of whipping it on quick because I want to, I got to let this dry, but I know this eye is going to take me some time. So I just want to get everything all evened up and cover up my mask me. That's what Katrina told me that this morning. So I don't have, I don't have that one. I got to get it. Cause I don't think this mask thing is going away anytime soon, but, um, I think I would just spot treatment. I really don't think I would put foundation on anyways, just because like I'm literally wearing a mask anytime I leave my office, like to get up and go to the bathroom, to get up and go out into our showroom, to get up and leave. Like it's literally anytime I'm not sitting in my office by myself. So I just don't see a point in putting foundation on period, but I do need some tea tree to, for spot treatment. So I do know that. I'm like, this foundation is not this difficult to get on. I'm just using a brush that's not dense enough. Okay, but I wanted to get my skin at least somewhat, somewhat together. And I gotta let this dry. Because these liquid, or matte liquid lipsticks, once they're dry, they're dry. But I can still feel it kind of tacky. So let's go in with a little bit more. But no, but I have heard, I have never had acne prone skin. And it's not that it's acne prone now either. It's just I'm breaking out where I'm wearing the mask. Um. So like tea tree, I've never really thought about it. Or got it for myself. Because I didn't think I would need it. But um. On the daily, though, if you are acne prone, putting that tea tree serum in with your foundation totally helps. Or just spot treatment, whatever, but tip there for any acne prone friends. Oh, this brush. When I first got it, I'm like, oh, this is legit. And then I, like, looked in my mirror up close. I'm like, oh, no, it's not. I got a set on Amazon. It had super high ratings. And, um, like, it's a whole brush set. for Like, a whole, it's like 16 brush set. And, like, the eye brushes and stuff are okay. But this foundation brush is just not dense enough. And then literally like a week after I got these in the mail, pharmacy launched a whole bunch of new brushes. And I just could not justify getting them because I had just gotten a whole bunch of new brushes. I have some I can send you when I get back. Ooh, yes, please, Robin. That would be awesome. I need to place an order anyways. But um, like I said, tea tree is just not one of those things like I feel like I need to have on hand because I don't have... Acne prone skin. 
Okay, so this is taking a hot minute to dry. On your lips, it does not take that much to dry, or that long. Okay, so if this doesn't dry, this is going to poop real quick. <laughs> because, here's what I'm going for. Color's gonna be different. But I figured I'd go pink. So I was looking at browns, and browns are fun, but like all these other like makeup looks I've been doing lately have been more of like browns and oranges and stuff like that. So I'm like, mm, I need to try something different. Be back next Friday, shoot me a reminder. Ooh, will do. And have fun in Florida. I'm jealous. We actually have some nice weather here again. We had snow. We had 20 degree, what, like 20 degree days. Like, no joke. I'm pretty sure one day the high was like 23. Which is flipping cold and windy, so that's even more flipping cold. And we had snow, and it was a mess. And then today, this week, it's been 70s, which is glorious, and I'm not complaining about that. But I'm like, how? How does it go from 20 degrees and snowing to beautiful 70 degrees? Like, it's just nuts. Chucky, leave the door alone. My cat, I swear. Okay, so it still feels kind of tacky. Poop in a group. Um, hmm. So I have a liquid eyeliner. And it's not very good. It's um one that I had gotten in an Ipsy subscription a very, very, very long time ago. And I've used it a couple times. And I'm, actually, I might use that one as the black. Because what I'm, I'm going to do the black, I was planning on doing the black and the white. But the fact that this is like. Still feeling kind of tacky. I know as soon as I start like drawing lines on it, I feel like it's gonna like be bad. <laughs> be bad quick. Because when you put these liquid liquid matte lipsticks on your lips, when they're dry, they are dry. It's 70s in Michigan too. I'll be in 90 degrees in a couple days. Oh, 90s sound nice. 70s is like after being 20s, 70s. Is like it's beautiful outside. It is so nice outside, but I wouldn't mind some nineties, especially Florida nineties. Less super humid, but I don't think this time of year it's super humid. Because humidity, that's a whole different story. Ninety and humid, that's that's ucky. It gets humid here in the summer, and that that's not fun. Um, I'm stalling. <laughs> I don't know if I should attempt my liquid eyeliner that I have that's a good four or five years old or if I attempt my pencil and risk it smearing because I'm going to do black and white lines to achieve my flannel my pink flannel I feel like the black might go on pretty good the white I'm kind of nervous about because it's one of these type of pencils and on my waterline, it goes on pretty darn good. I think it'll go on pretty good here. I mean, it's it's pretty white. It's it's pigmented. I'm just scared. No pencil do liquid. Well, I gotta do the pencil for the white because that I, that I don't have another option there. Because this is what I'm going for, and I I could do just pink and black, I suppose. But my liquid one, and it's like so thick, like it's. This is not pharmacy that I'm not promoting this because I've used it a couple times and it is not, it's not legit. Because in order to get that look, I need like some long or some thicker and some thinner. We're just going to try it. I'm nervous. Just white pencil, but black liquid. Okay, I'm doing it. So I'm going to go, I think, up and down first and then some sideways. If my eye was a square, it would be a lot easier. And then if I can get my lines straight, too. That's going to be, that's going to be a whole other story. Oh, boy, I'm nervous. Yeah, see this? It's like, it skips. Like, it doesn't make a full stroke. This stuff is not very good. One line, my eyes closed, it's kind of straight. 
and the straight lines are just not you don't drive okay so here's a thick line Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Gotta get Sophia to bed. Be right back. Sounds good. I'll be here. Attempting to make some straight lines here. Oh boy. And I'm so glad I only committed to one eye. <laughs> well, that one went almost straight down. Oh, good Lord. This is looking more like a tiger. Okay. So we got some lines going down. I'm going to have to just do some white in between and hope that this works. Yeah, I'm going to kind of try and line... Match these up, I think, make a square. Do I do that? Do I make it a square? I think we should make sure that the lines are connected. I knew this was not going to be easy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Hopefully the white will bring it together. Hopefully the white will bring it together. Okay. So we're going to let that dry finish the face, shall we? <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, do some bronzer. I have not done bronzer or blush or highlight or the bottom of my face all week. I'm like super excited to actually like finish my face here. This is the Peach Bite palette. It rocks. Blush, bronzer, blush, bronzer, highlight, all in one, super neutral colors, buildable, amazing. Amazing. We're not done with that eye. I don't know if I should connect those or not. It's tough because everything flannel I saw was so... Nothing, you know, my eye's not square, obviously. And I never did find an eye look. Since I only committed to one, I'm going to do something fun with this other one. But I do have the matte liquid lipstick on that one too. So that is a really pretty shade for an eye. So that worked out. Okay, where's my blush? Oh, the toots was playing with some brushes. Robin? Where did my blush brush go? That's the one I was using. Well, we're gonna use this one. I'm letting the black dry. Because we got hot mess going on. I had a funny feeling that this was going to happen. And now I don't know. Am I watching live, Robin? Do I connect the top? Do I, like, attempt to make a square? So I'm going I'm to put white in there. I'm letting it dry, though, before I touch it again. 
You're totally going out of your comfort zone with this one. I love it. You know, I did um, that Twiggy one, and like I just feel like nothing can be worse than that. So, you know, I tried. I'm trying. It is what it is. I'm having fun. Totally out of the comfort zone for sure, though. Yeah, with Halloween, we had a Halloween challenge. Wouldn't connect it. I don't think so either. I think once it's, I gotta let it dry because you can tell when I went over this way, the going, I went down first. They weren't fully dry when I went over. So yes, yeah, so I'm gonna let that just set for a minute. Um. Oh, but we there was a Halloween challenge out there too, and I did not participate in that one. Not to be like stick in the mud or anything, but like I'm just not artsy, like. And to me, like, something that I'm not even remotely good at is not fun for me. Like, I like Halloween, don't get me wrong, but, like, face painting and stuff like that is just not, it's not my thing. I feel like I'd have been sitting down here just, like, frustrated as all hell throughout every look I was trying. So, hopefully by next year I will be, you know, I'll be playing with makeup for a lot longer. And um, I think it'll be a lot more fun next year. Um... And I will try some more stuff probably. But this year I was like, I was seeing all these looks that the girls were doing. And I was like, ah. I guess that it just, I don't know. It's not like I couldn't have done it. I'm sure I probably could have, but I just, I'm still learning makeup in general. So I would, I would like to focus more on that. Like all these looks I've been doing in the morning. Because this whole challenge, not everything is flannel on the eyes. But um, all the stuff that we've been doing are the other parts of this. Like there's some really pretty looks. Like I did caramel this morning. I'm not an artist either and took two and a half hours for each look. It's really not that hard. Yeah, but I watch you and you make it look like it's so easy. Like I know it takes time, but you freaking rock there, Robin, by the way. Um... So it's dry to the touch, like it's not coming off of my finger. So the white, like I said, I'm scared. I'm like trying to rub it, like get it on my hand. Like there is some pigment to it. I just know I'm gonna have to rub it pretty good. So I think the whole little line, skinny line thing, that didn't work, that's the size of my lines. That um, I kind of was worried that was gonna happen because this, and I think this is a decent bread, I'm not sure. But deep down, that was stressing. But at the same time, there's nothing to stress about because who really cares? I mean, like, you do, obviously, and like I do, but but not really. Like, it's just, it's fun to play and try. Okay, that's actually working. Okay, not as bad as I thought. Not too shabby, not too shabby. I wouldn't, um, I don't know that this necessarily looks like flannel, but you know, I tried. I'm trying. I have not turned down very many of these challenges, so pretty much only the Halloween, Hall Halloween ones, I think, were the only ones I haven't done. I think I've pretty much done everything else. There's been a lot. Oh, this is wonky here. That white's actually turning up a lot more than I thought it was gonna. Yeah, I'm really excited to see other people's flannel looks they come up with because I searched and searched and searched and didn't find any. Like I said, I found one gal that had lips that were all like flannel they were like red and green and like like full-on flannel but i did not find any eye ones i was like well let's uh look up a flannel shirt and i was kind of finding some and i'm like okay flannel and plaid are the same thing basically 
So let's look up different plaid looks. And I'm like, oh, I haven't done pink for a while. So hence, this is where we're at. So this is flannel. <laughs> Never thought about doing this eye look. I'm super proud of you. Thank you. This is my inspiration. It's pretty spot on, right? <laughs> oh my gosh. I should be drinking right now. It might look better. Did I say that in my all other place? I probably should be though. I'm a little toots to bed tonight. She was good, but we had a team call and she loves watching. Monday nights she can't watch with me because we like are like doing stuff. Like it's blitz type, like do stuff real fast. Um, but Thursdays is more like, I mean it's informational, but she can watch with me. And she watches color in a couple squares white. Like every other. Okay, I see where you're saying. Um, so she was watching the meeting with me and then she actually kind of ended up just kind of watching. She found, she somehow has found YouTube on her little tablet. It's our tablet, but we let her. She has some, like, toddler games on there that are, like, actually super educational, and she's really, really good at them, like, matching shapes and puzzles and stuff like that. I'm so sad I missed the meeting. I was on urgent care with my son. Yeah, I saw that, and then I saw he was okay, so that's good. Just a sprain, right? Um, no, it was good. It was a good call. Um, but she watches with me, and then when we get done... It's like 7.30, which is like basically her let's read books and go to bedtime. But then it was like she wasn't comprehending that because I had just got done with the meeting and like she hasn't had like her like snuggle cartoon time. So getting her to bed tonight was a little bit more of a struggle, but she was good. I'm glad she was good. Yesterday she was not good. She, um, she's... Sassy for me, which is one thing. But she was sassy at daycare yesterday, and I got three different notes throughout the day because she has an app. And I got three notes that she was being naughty. And I, like, I didn't even know what to do. I was so mad because she's always been so good. So we basically came home, made supper. Got jammies on, read books, and went to bed. So I, just, I was so mad. Like, and I know she's two and a half, but um, I just, I could not believe that my sweet little angel was so naughty. And I will never be the mom that's like, oh, my kid can do new wrong. Oh, she was naughty because other people were like, no, 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 no. I don't care who else was naughty. I know you're only two and a half. You don't act like that. <laughs> and this morning, I'm like, you be good girl. Like, you know, tight, like, oh my gosh. Hey, oh, hey, Tammy. You hopped on for a good one. Can you tell what I'm doing? Let's see, anybody just hopping on? Can you guess what I'm doing? I guess I have it in the description. Never mind. Robin, I hope this is what you meant by filling some in. Shut the age of the little attitude is going to come out full force. And it totally has with me. And, like, that's okay. Like, to me, her attitude and her sassiness is, like, her personality is coming out. And, like, showing me, like, she does have a personality. And, like, I like I don't question she has a personality. But, like, it's okay. But for her to misbehave for somebody else, it just, like, makes my insides hurt. Like, I was so mad when I picked her up. Like, I'm always so excited to get, you know, to, to see her the first time. And she says, Mike, get time out. I'm like, I know you did. Why were you naughty? Um, and then off on to the next whatever. We learn letter F today or whatever. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I was not happy with her yesterday. But today she was good. 
She said every time she needed to go potty, she stayed dry all day. She's doing super good with potty training. We were struggling with number twos for a while, TMI, but anybody that's got a two-year-old understands. Um, and she's been rocking it. She has been doing so good. I'm so proud of her. Hey, hop, hop up. Kitty, get up. My cats. If it's not my toddler, it's my cats. Robin, I hope that's what you meant by filling some of them in because, um, this is final. <laughs> that's what we're going for. Try. Oh, my goodness. Kind of did it every other one. And this, it stinks because, like, that stupid eyeliner. Okay. I don't know what else I can do with that, to be honest. So let's, let's move on to the other eye, shall we? And I'm not doing flannel over here because, like I said, I would think I would just be super frustrated if I couldn't get them even. And there is no way in heck I'm getting them even. So I kind of wanted to just do something fun over here. What can I do that's fun? Maybe I should smoke it out. Could I do a pink smoky eye? Let's do a pink smoky eye. Why not? Why not? This is 9.30 already. Holy bananas. Um, so I got black going on over here. So I should probably keep it the black theme. Alright, where's the money? Excuse me. Black. Hmm. <laughs> what brush am I okay with getting black on? <laughs> I need to wash my brushes so bad. So bad. Um, black. Let's do this little guy. I can blend it out. What do you think? Flannel? I'm such a pro. Not even close. Okay. No, oh, this was not the brush. That's not a good. Nope. That's not gonna work. Flannel's hard. Yeah. I'm curious to see what you do, Robin, and what anybody else does, because nobody's done it yet. So I'm like, um, I didn't really know what she meant by that. Like, I knew a makeup look, but, um, yeah, I'm really curious to see. Learn from my mistakes. <laughs> Don't do this. <laughs> Whatever you do. I have never done a pink smoky eye, but this is looking Like a bit much, but not close to what you're doing. I'm in, I'm, uh, I'm intrigued. So part of me kind of wanted to wait to see until somebody like other people did the flannel one, but then I'm like, I'm just going to do it. I'm going to do it. Cause if I watch other people make, oh my God, there's no way I can do that or whatever and check it out. So and I was like, well, I need to do comfy day, comfy cozy or whatever that one is. I'm like, because that, that's like free space right there. So I was thinking about doing that tonight. But um, I was like, nope, I'm just going to do it. I'm just going to do it. So then y'all can learn from me. Don't do this. I'm curious to see what you come up with, Robin. I don't know what I got. Some of my eyeball there. All right, some smoked out eye there. I went pretty heavy on the highlight too. My whole face is looking good. Even in my mask knee spots. Sweet. Honestly, I bought a flannel shirt and found super cute eye look. You're just going to match your eye look to your shirt, aren't you? 
cheater. <laughs> and I looked through my closet. I used to have a black and pink flannel shirt years ago, like a lot of years ago, like probably 10 plus years ago. And I don't have it anymore. Usually I keep clothes because I wish, or I always have the hope that they will fit again. And then I went through a stage and like, I'm getting rid of everything. I think it was when I was pregnant, actually. I um, got rid of a whole bunch of stuff. Cause I'm like, my body's never going to be the same, blah, blah, blah. Well, I actually got very lucky and lost a lot of weight after she was born. Um, so most of my stuff does fit. But I think that was one of those ones where I'm like, nope, never going to fit again. So if I would have had that, because that was my first thought too. I'm like, let's just match a, I look to that. See, if you're laughing. That is totally what you're doing. And here I am. I should get double points. Just saying. So I'm not just matching an I look to a shirt. Anybody could do that. Oy, oy, oy. You're watching, say hey. I know Robin's watching me. See some other numbers up there. Who else is here? There was. I scared him off. What the hell is she doing here? That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta finish it off here. I'm lining my eyes. Poking my eyes. Oh, I did so good this morning. Might be going a little out of the box. Well, we'll see. I just made literally poke my eye and now it's watering. Um, I didn't poke it to where I like hurt, but just poked it enough to where eyeball running. Um, what was I saying? I have no idea. I'm gonna finish this off. Eyeliner and some mascara, and I don't know what else I can do. Might be going out of the out of the box. Are you talking about my box on my eyeball, or are you talking about your box and what you're doing with your look, Robin? Because this is about as out of the box you can get. <laughs> and I was talking with my husband this weekend about it too. Cause he's super artsy. I have got to get him on here doing my makeup because I think he would do such a good job because he is so artsy. He's like, no, no. We'll see one of these days. Um, but he's like, that won't be that hard. And he takes like markers and he starts drawing. He's like, just go like this and like this and fill in here. I'm like, you're making this look. I'm like, you realize we're doing this on an eyelid, not a box, not on a piece of paper. My box tomorrow, eight, 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 nine, your time, nine thirty. My eight to nine. Um, it's tomorrow, Friday. I should probably be able to watch that. Well, if not, I'll watch the replay and see the pictures regardless, but I will try and hop on yours. Um, I'm gonna do some mascara and I don't know. Robin, what else can I do? Help girl out here. I'm kind of digging this. That whole business there. And that was just to make the thing kind of come together. And it's not coming together. I know that. Ah, I'm well aware. Let's do some 3D or some Zen. Let's do Zen. I haven't done Zen in a while. Your looks are always so fun, Robin. It was, yeah, and never mind. I was gonna say with 3D, I usually curl my lashes and I don't wanna, really don't wanna get um, black and white all over my eyelash curler. A little black's probably dry, but. I don't know that mascara is gonna help this at all. Probably not. It's hard to tell with this craziness on my eye, but this Zen mascara is insane. It like lifts and separates and lengthens. It is 
amazing. Do you have a darker pink? You can add a little flannel to the side. What? Do you have a darker pink? You can add a little to the flannel side. Are you talking like in my the pink squares? No. So I only have two liquid matte lipsticks and they are Nude Essence and All Natural. And that was All Natural. So I think Nude Essence would be, that's like more like orangey. I did that one on my eyes last week one day. And it's definitely more of like an orangey. I don't know what I'm trying to say. It's not pink. It doesn't come off as pink on my eyes. I don't know that that would work. Okay, I forgot what I said. Okay. Forgotten. This mascara. One of these days I'm going to master mascara. And when I do, the world's going to know it because <laughs> I, for the life of me, cannot do it without getting it on my eyelid. It wipes off. I mean, that's, that's great. But it'd be nice if it, like, I could just put it on and that not happen to begin with. This wand, though. No joke, I stab myself in the eye almost every time. I don't stab, like, I stab myself in the eye more so when I'm doing my lower lash line with a brush, like shadow, or I, like, flip shadow into my eye, or my eyeliner pencil. Mascara, I don't ever jab myself in the eye. I just cannot do it without it getting, <laughs> this one you can't tell. And that one I probably did perfect and it didn't get on there at all because it's such a mess. But like that, I just can't get it to not... Get on my lip. But you can tell, like, I have lashes now. That Zen mascara. If you do not have this, you need it. And what is it? Eight, eight ninety, nine ninety. Retail, retail. So that's crazy. Lashes look pretty legit. Okay. What else can I do? Put this on my lips. That's what I can do. So this is the same color. Oh, natural. Eight ninety. Yeah, crazy. And the wand is nuts. But it picks up upper lashes is crazy it separates and then when you like turn it it um robin you're distracting me with all of your hearts but thank you <laughs> when you turn the wand it's like shorter so you can get your lower lash line it's it's crazy the wand itself is worth eight dollars but yeah mascara is legit i like this color on my lips Cause I'm not a lipstick wearer. I'm getting there. I'm I'm getting there. I'm getting there. But I see when I see myself, um, like when I do pictures, like after these looks and stuff, when I have this color on, I I do like it. Cause at first I'm like, oh, it's so close to my natural color, but it's not. It's actually lighter. Cause I have very 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 pigmented lips, obviously. Um, but I do dig this. Should I do something else to the lips? What else should I do? I can't make it any worse because we already have a gorgeous flannel going on here. <laughs> the rest is good. I got like crazy smoky eye. Crazy smoky eye going on with my flannel. I, um, just to say, before this even started, I said, 
This is either going to turn out looking really awesome or it's going to be a super hot mess. If you go like this, super awesome. <laughs> super hot mess. Flannel. I tried. I tried. This is kind of what I was going for. I knew the shade wasn't going to be the same. I'm like, oh, I can do lines. Yeah, no, not so much. Not so much. Um, I don't know. Am I done? I think. Let's do this. It's because it's sitting right in front of me. Highlighter on my lips. Sure, why not? <laughs> you still rock. I think you did great. Well, Robin, thank you very much. You are a very good liar. Very bad. Bad liar. Whatever. So, yeah, I got my smoky eye. I got my flannel. I got some highlighter on my lips. <laughs> oh, I think I'm done, you guys. That was fun. That was fun. It's always funner when I'm not, like, trying. Well, I mean, I tried. I totally tried. Don't get me wrong. But it was fun. I tried. I didn't just get a flannel shirt and I'm matching an eye look to a flannel shirt. Nope, I full-on tried flannel on my eyeball. This is how it turned out. Would I do it again? No. Probably not. But, hey. I tried. Okay, get all this put away and see. I don't think I missed anything. For not being used to out of the box looks. Yeah, I don't, I the only other crazy one I did was the, that Twiggy one when I tried doing like, drew on lashes and like drew, it. that was not good at all. But at least this one, like I think, you can kind of tell what I was, you can at least tell what I was going for. You can definitely tell what I was going for. But my face, like I said, that is like, so not me, but that looks like an awesome smoky eye. And these lips, totally dig these lips. I did that once before and put a little bit of highlight on there like that. I do like that. And I got nice glowy skin thanks to my VFX foundation. Super nice. This stuff rocks. Okay. Well, I think I'm done. <laughs> Thanks for hanging with me. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.